What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Show back with another video. And today, I'm talking about legends again. Now, I've been doing uh, the shiny hunt. Uh, if you've been seeing on the channel, I've been going and basically farming shiny alpha Pokemon. And honestly, that's been cool. That's been cool. Uh, I feel like, in general, uh, I'm, I'm running out of shiny alphas to get. There are a couple of I haven't actually uploaded yet, but I'm going to start going to like trying to find shiny, like the shiny regular Pokemon. But um, I've been playing Pokemon a lot, you know, to, to do this. I've been playing a lot, and it's very tiring, for sure. Um, I've been playing other games in the meantime, like maybe like a little bit of Dying Light. But today, I'm really here to talk about a couple missed opportunities that I feel like Legends just really needed to implement. Now, the main one I'm going to talk about today is multiplayer. Now, I, I have a group of friends, right? And they are kind of like, they're kind of like me. You know, I'm not really a crazy Pokemon fan. I've enjoyed the games, but my real enjoyment has been like playing against other people. So for me, it's like... Having no like online multiplayer and stuff is kind of a, a downside for me, but it's not a major downside because uh, when I actually started playing the game, I didn't know it wouldn't have any online capabilities. And I understand that we can't actually trade. That's a thing you can you can trade or whatever. But um, I wasn't aware that it was it wasn't any online capabilities. And as I was playing the game, I started to realize that um, you know going through this um, quote unquote en enhanced wild area, like you know just because that's basically what it is is a wild area that's just done better like going through these uh things like these fields hunting pokemon could be very interesting if we had the more of a co-op experience uh you know something like make the alphas harder but you know and, and, I, and I get that that could call like it's it's weird how would they really implement that because it since it's like okay who catches the pokemon and stuff but it would just be interesting maybe to just like run around in the in the zone and just like like fighting battle your own pokemon and be in the same world and then if you guys wanted to battle all you had to do is just throw the pokemon at each other which would be interesting because that's literally how the new system is built now to answer the question does this really matter like does this hurt the game anyway no i have a lot of hours into this game i've been playing this game i've been enjoying this game i've been enjoying it so much that i'm willing to really call it um you know one of my top five pokemon games which thinking about it it's not really a lot a lot of the newer ones aren't really that great so i don't think that multiplayer kind of hinders it a little bit and i know nintendo really doesn't care about sales but i've heard a lot of people say they're not getting the game because they feel like if they can't battle their friends then they can't really get the game because it's not really going to be an enjoyable experience for them so the way i look at this, this is more of a single player experience you know like you would go out and play spider-man or you know god of war or something like that this is pokemon but a single player experience i've always come into this game look, looking like it was pokemon coliseum by the way I, I think i'm gonna have some gameplay of that coming out soon so uh, check that out but yeah honestly I, it, it's, it's not a it's not a super negative for me i do feel as though it's i mean it's it's, it's always gonna be a good game to me i've always gonna kind of look back and see and say to myself maybe this could have been multiplayer and it would have got a little bit of enjoyment out of me. But I really like being able to go around and study Pokemon and just kind of like be in the, in the moment. Like just don't really worry about like another person. Just, this is my single player Pokemon experience. Also, I mean, if I'm not mistaken, this is a, I'm guessing this is a spinoff and not a mainline series. Hopefully we'll get more of these in the future because I would love to explore all these different regions. And that'd be interesting. So with that being said, guys. I want to know down in the comments below, how do you feel about there being no multiplayer? Does it really hurt the game? Like, does it literally hurt the game? Do you think people are really not buying it because of the multi no multiplayer? Is that a deal breaker for you? If you're listening to this right now and you haven't bought the game, is that a deal breaker for you? Or is it something else about the game you don't want to partake in? Is it like the graphics? You know, just what is it? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you have gotten the game and you've been playing it, do you feel like the game would have been enhanced with like multiplayer battling? Because I keep saying multiplayer, but I mean like like battling other trainers is what I'm trying to say. So with that being said, guys, thanks for watching. Please like subscribe, and I'll see you guys next video. Marty, 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 Marty.